What signals are you sending? Why do people have job interviews, particularly for highly technical jobs? Let's assume we are visiting aliens on Earth and we need to report on human behavior. We are a highly advanced species, kind of like Vulcans. From a pure logical frame of mind, it seems like a huge waste of time to actually have job interviews. If a person is skilled and has the requisite certifications, that should be enough, right? Maybe we need to know things that aren't on their resume, like if they were late or had problems with other people at work. But these issues could easily be resolved by talking to the person's list of references. Call up a few co-workers and ask them how they were. Certainly, this would be enough to make a hiring decision, right? But these silly humans still need to talk to the guy. It's not to see what he looks like. They could require a video sit along with his or her resume explaining all their strengths and weaknesses. These silly humans still need to have a face-to-face -face discussion. And since we are Vulcans, we might also ask why people have such lengthy courtship processes. I mean, we Vulcans just need to do a DNA test of our potential spouse. Make sure they come from an upstanding family and that's that, right? So long as their DNA shows they are healthy and they come from a reputable family, why would we even need to see them? Since we are humans and not Vulcans, we know the answer. Most of what we know about somebody takes a long time to know, and it requires not looking at a list of their best qualities. We want to see them behave in real time. We want to talk to a potential new hire to see how he answers the questions. We want to spend a lot of time with a potential lover to see how well they respond to uncertain or unexpected situations. For example, you might be on your first or second date with somebody you think is ideal until they get really angry at the waiter for a silly reason. You may think some new engineer is perfect on paper, but within the first few minutes of the conversation, you already know there is something off about them. Casting directors sort through thousands of potential actors for certain parts. To the extent these casting directors do their jobs well, they see things most others would miss. All of these ideas are based on an intuitive understanding. How we humans tend to be able to sniff things out, or more accurately, feel things out about each other. But here's the kind of harsh part. Some of this nonverbal communication is what we are broadcasting all the time. Just like the interviewer knows within seconds if this guy is a good fit or not, so do other people. If you are broadcasting the wrong signals, it's going to be hard to overcome that. On the other hand, if you are broadcasting the right signals, you can slide right in. To learn how, visit mindpersuasion.com forward slash 3x3.